Join us right now is former Massachusetts Senator Scott Brown, who is again running for Senate, this time from New Hampshire. He joins us live today from Manchester. Good morning to you, sir. Good morning to you, Steve. Well, you called for Eric Shinseki's resignation the first week in November. It's interesting, though, now this is bipartisan. There are a number of Republicans and Democrats who say he has got to go. Well, that's true. It, it shouldn't take... Uh more deaths and more people slipping through the cracks because moms and, and families are asking, you know, how many people are going to die or slip through the cracks before you lose your job. And it's no different in this instance where you have somebody who's given great service to our country, but he needs to go. The president needs to set the tone. He needs to set the agenda. And he needs, needs to let the veterans know that he's serious about really uh, changing and, and clarifying and fixing this very real problem. Sure. What? what uh, to this year of action that the president was talking about, where I got a pen and I got a phone and I'll get stuff done. He, he could fix this pronto, but instead he says, I'm going to wait for another report. We've already heard from the IG of the VA, and he's already said, yep, they've had these uh, gaming strategies going on for years. Listen, you know, you know it as well as I know it. We don't need any more studies. We don't need any more hearings. Uh, there are bills on Harry Reid's desk. I'm not shocked. I'm just going to say it's not uncommon to have bills sitting on Harry Reid's desk. They could address this in a moment's notice. They could fix it, make it a priority, but they're not. They're playing political games with it, and they need to do what's right for our veterans. As I was around yesterday on Memorial Day doing many parades and the, the day before, right. the one theme that I heard is when is the president, when is the Senate going to do something about sure. this? And I have, as you know, called for this uh, to be fixed right away. My, my opponent, Senator Shaheen, is with the president once again. As you know, she votes 99 percent of the time. You think there's 1 percent of the time she would agree with our veterans and do what's right for them.